Peace. Sorry. Hopefully I can edit it in together on YouTube. I think I can, so I, I think I probably can edit it in. They're going to say insert clip or something like that though as well. So I might be, be able to put this in the front and then put the other one in the bag. So I don't know. I'll see how this goes. If not, it's just going to be in two posts because I don't give a fuck. Like, does that make sense? Y'all know I don't believe in editing things. Whoever this is though as well, they got drunk and they said something though as well and they really exposed this person or who they was to you though as well because you could have been thinking about is they friend foe they friend for or they for against you or something like that. That was weird because it said stop and stop rushing. Rome wasn't built in the night. So you could have thought this person really fucked with you and the whole time they really didn't fuck with you and they could have fucked you up. That was weird because it's somebody that is very spiteful, jealous, envious of other people. This could be a sexual connection that you got going on with somebody else. They be sending off death magic, death threats and doing so and so on. And this person is not changing. Whoever this is, though, is where you may be dealing with a false prophet or somebody that is... Uh, ganging up with certain people to bring you certain problems, though, as well. And some of y'all, y'all may be lying about this, though, as well. Like, I don't know somebody. I'm hearing something about time travel. That's too advanced for my pay grade. I just got back on the internet. Uh, this could be somebody where you could be lying about a lot of things that it is that they do or certain things that it is that they did. So some of y'all, it's kind of like you keep excusing somebody else's behavior when it comes down to a lot of situations in your life, though, as well. Some of y'all, somebody could have went to a dark high priest or something like that, though, as well, across the globe or possibly in Asia. You could have went to some form. You could have went to go ask for some state advice because it said you could be asking or searching for some state advice though as well. But it said watch the advice that you give and also the advice that you receive. So again, with the high priestess being reversed, you didn't listen to whoever the fuck this is though as well. So you could have walked smack dab into a setup because you also got ten of wands. Some of y'all you need to stop posting so much on social media because this is a reverse. It said take a social media cleanse. Uh, four ones. Some you got four ones. Some of y'all definitely need to stop posting certain shit on social media because certain people that you hang with, kick it with, they are not for you. Whoever this is, or somebody needs to learn this, flip the roads. Whoever this is, if it's a Gemini cause or shit, and you the Gemini going through. It's going to be half and half. Now, for some of y'all, whoever this is that you allow to come over to your house, though, as well, you allow somebody to come over your house and they install something on your devices. For some of y'all, they didn't install something on your devices. This is a person where they came back with an entity or something like that on them. So, again, you could have been like, what's wrong with you? What's wrong with your eyes? Why you look like that? What the fuck going on or something like that, though, as well? Did somebody got a hold of something? Whatever the fuck it is, they got a hold of something. What type of spiritual uh, spiritual practices, whatever nuances and stuff like that that was going on. Somebody got their ass up in a heap of fire. I'm just going to be honest. Because we also got level up, shame. We also got seasons and we also got manifestations. And this is not that thing to get some state of money. Some of y'all, this may be somebody that was trying to shame you. I'm just going to be honest. So again, this may be somebody that looked down on others because they look really look down on themselves when they come down to a lot of situations though as well. So whoever this is, if they plans fail and turn things and go to fruition though as well, this is where this person may be showing some type of more symptoms of like, oh, I shouldn't have never done it. I shouldn't have never did this though as well though because again if they like say for somebody went out of town they got some state of advice to somebody they had to do this between certain moons certain times certain places and stuff like that though as well whoever this is they came back because the ritual didn't stick they came back and they continuously kept doing the shit though as well and whoever this is they feel like they running out of time or whoever this is if they had something to do with some state of money or where if it's money ritual whatever fuck it is Baby, somebody broke. So this is why somebody coming back and saying, oh, oh my God. So they might just be trying to put all this glamour magic on them to make them seem like they're alluring and stuff like that though as well. They gonna put a whole lot of glamour magic on them though as well to hike up their sex appeal. And you may be wondering like, damn, I ain't seen them in a long time. Ooh, you gonna be wondering why you just got it on for them or something like that though as well the whole entire time. It's magic, baby. Because they're trying to get something from you, though, as well. Possibly even a fucking sacrifice or possibly even your child or something like that, though. Because with the storms and we also got joy. This is a mood killer. This is somebody that's also trying to take something of yours from you so that you can be in a state of lack. And this is something that somebody found happiness in or something like that, though. Now, for some of y'all, I'm going to keep it a bang. If you're in a relationship with somebody, you know your man was in the army or something like that, though. I need to do a 23 to me on my uncle. I need to hit what you call up though as well because I think he got some kids because he used to stay low talk about a certain continent and place he used to go and I think that nigga got some kids over there because he always used to hit on it. And he used to be laying them seeds wide. Like, I'm just going to be there. He was some kids. Never mind. He was in the army. He used to have some kids. That nigga used to be laying them down and piping them down. Mm. Disgusting. So I know he got some little kids over there. Neither here nor there. Whoever this is, some of y'all may have found out about a child or about a child or something like that though gonna cause a whole lot of chaos or something like that though as well i don't know whoever this is now for some of y'all if you are new time moms or something like that though you may be going through a crisis because your baby ain't let you 
Now, for some of y'all, when it come down to your baby not latching on to you, though, as well, please stop listening to them hoes on motherfucking TikTok because they feel like your child not going to have no state of nourishment. And, baby, it's it's just in you when it come down to parenting and stuff like that, though, as well. People feel to recognize that's what you got that whole nine months for. You're going to sing to your baby, talk to your baby, rub your stomach, eat. Y'all kick it together. Y'all buzz. Stop letting these bitches that's on the internet try to tell you on some holistic shit that you need to breastfeed your kid. And this bitch want cocaine away from blowing the fuck up. Stop listening to people like that, though, as well. Everybody ain't able to, and some people can. I know they say they talk about it's healthy for the immune system and stuff like that, though, as well. But, baby, you don't eat right, and that body ain't good. Baby, that baby just ain't getting no immune system. You might as well feed that baby dirt and let that motherfucking immune system get a book of the whites. So stop listening to people, please. Now, we also got mask. We also got shine. We also got desire. We also got sacred lust, and we also got to surrender. I'm here to be just like me. So whoever this is, somebody wants to be like you. Again, somebody wants to be like you. They want to be desired. They want to be enamored. They want these particular things though as well. And so somebody needs to give up the gist at this same time though as well. Because whoever this is though, they may not be getting the proper attention that it is that they need. So you may got a mini me or a follower or something like that though. They may be following up behind you though as well. Whether this is your child, your child may be in front of you. And you may not like this. Or this is a person that it is that you know they may be acting like you or something like that though as well and whoever this is they are not getting the right attention at the same time because we got seven of cups and we also got nine of swords and you may be worried about this or this person may be worried about their health or their financial well-being so again this is somebody that needs some fatal counsel so again if somebody lying say they're a prophet they're not a prophet i'll tell you it's a false prophet if somebody's lying and saying that um Somebody going to someone, like somebody's going to someone under the state of guidance with that hair fund though as well. Somebody's still lying to you. Seven of cups and also seven of swords. So somebody playing you, baby, whoever this is, somebody playing you and giving you some badass advice though as well. And they keep you in a lot of mental confusion though as well. Especially if there's any type of childhood trauma, you experiencing any type of brain fog or something like that though as well. If you have been feeling like you've been constantly going through like time loops or constant energetic shifts and stuff like that though as well. Somebody may be lying about the paternity of a kid or a kid or something like that, though. And somebody's also lying about uh their wealth, their abundance. So, again, if you like those particular people that be saying, oh, I'm royal, I'm royal, I'm royal, they do bullshit. Baby, move the fuck out of my way. Let me see the fruits of your labor. Because, again, you can see that. So, again, somebody's getting caught up into a state of lies, though, is where I'm telling you. It ain't always a state of money. So, some of y'all may be dealing with people who be saying, like, I'm royal, I'm royal, I'm royal. But again, the motherfuckers really ain't royal when it comes down to a lot of situations because the fruits of their labor still going to burn. Like a lot of people be thinking that it's material, but again, it's just certain things where you be knowing motherfuckers will be tapped in. Like I'm saying, it just be showing. And again, this may be something that you may be learning though as well because again, the error of somebody else's ways is causing them a whole bunch of destruction in their life though as well. So they got to figure it out. It's not your job though too. So again, you may end up in court or you may have to make a logical decision down to you and this person though as well where there's a lot of chaos that's going on where you want to take this person to court you may want to sue them or you may be at the point where you just like bitch i'm done with you some of y'all may come to that point with male or female where you may just be like babe i'm over you i'm done i ain't coming back because again this is a lot that's coming out at one time though as well like it's shaking the foundations of relationships people places and also connections that you have with certain people so i don't know who lied this goddamn bad but somebody lied a lot of bad Let me have it. Or you won't get this video. Like, somebody lied like a lot of bad. Somebody lied like a lot of bad. Like, they lied a lot. Like, somebody lied like a lot of big. They did. Somebody lied like a lot of big. But that's okay. Yeah, everybody makes mistakes. Hey, what I got there? What you do with it? My man, what you do with that deck? That little deck that I had that was great. Where is it? Where is it? Give me that one. Give me that one. So somebody may have lied that it was a good event with the page of swords. We also got the knight of wands. You may feel like they were just being close to you, whether they were close to people or around you or something like that, though, as well. It was somebody that was close to you that told them to do this at the same time, or this is somebody that was connecting with someone. Like, this could be somebody that was sitting back pocket watching or stalking you or something like that, though, as well. Definitely on the page of swords. This could be somebody that you can know how to say something to pick you up when you're going through a challenging time and stuff like that, though, as well. Whoever this is, they came off like a codependent at the same time, though, but this is somebody. They came off like someone who you could depend on. So it became a codependent relationship between you and someone else. And the whole entire time, this person was stabbing you in your goddamn house. And you didn't know that though as well. So this is somebody who was trying to come in and seek it. They ease that shit back in. And some of y'all was not paying attention to it though as well. This may be somebody that uh, you had a lot of 
destruction going on in your life though as well. Uh, they may have came off like there was a guide or something to you, especially if you had like a lot of dysfunction. So this could be somebody that prayed on the week. So they feel like you were weak when it comes down to a state of a situation, when it comes to your emotional affairs, and they cause a lot of problems. Look, because we got Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Wands. We also got the Five of Wands. We also got the Queen of Pentacles, and we also got the World card. That's why I said whoever this is that keep bringing something up, you and somebody else not going to be on the same page because there's too much drama going on. There's riffraff. Some of y'all need to scatter. Y'all need to get away from each other at this same time, though, as well, because y'all working tirelessly to get to the point with this world card because you're dealing with somebody else, though, as well. They may be a shapeshifter, so they know how to change themselves to get to um a certain position for some of y'all this may be somebody that may be a teacher so again some of y'all may be going through something with a teacher a student uh you may be a teacher a spiritualist whoever this is or somebody that calls themselves something like that though as well more in the spiritual aspects or not in the spiritual aspects but for some of y'all it's like a spiritual teacher or something like that though we got eight of wands we also got the seven of wands and reverse the page of pentacles and then we also got the sun card yep y'all definitely spirit where you've been putting your time. I do feel like that, though. Now, for some of y'all, somebody feels scattered mentally and stuff like that, though, as well. So, again, I don't know if you stay across the country or you live in the country. So, again, some of y'all may be trying to find a place to stay. So, this could be somebody I don't know if they want to stay in the U.S. or outside the U.S. So, y'all could be the in-between travels. Like, I don't know. Y'all could be like the people I know at the store where they say, I'm going to come over here about six months, eight months, and then I'm going to pack up and I'm going to go back for like eight months. And I'm like, hey, where the fuck y'all at? Does that make sense? So some of y'all may be into this and it may be something that you may be recognizing in between travels that you're not happy because with this queen and the page of pentacles, somebody needs some form of stability. Now, for some of y'all, I'm just keeping it being, you arguing with somebody though as well because if you got a baby mama, whoever this is, she money hungry and your child ungrateful as hell, whoever this is, I'm sorry. Somebody in your life, male or female, whoever this is, they are money hungry and your child is ungrateful as fuck. Now again, your child may be ungrateful because of the mother. You hear me say, just like me and stuff like that though as well so with this page of pentacles and a sun card this may not even make this child ha happy like y'all may be getting into it arguing over money and stuff like that though as well and the spirit just showing you that like this really don't have shit to do with me so again somebody may be at that point where your child may be like this ain't got shit to do with me we got Hierophant. We also got three of Pentacles, the five of five of Cups, the three of Pentacles, three of Wands, and we also got two of Swords. Somebody may be blaming you for losing out on a job or blaming you for losing a marriage or blaming you for doing something, though, as well. Again, so I don't know if this is somebody. We did say there's a fake teacher in the group chat. So, again, somebody may be blaming you for being exposed. But again, this is somebody that wants to walk in the light. And whoever this is that wants to walk in the light, they stole someone else's essence with this energy or energy transfer. And they were pretending to be something that they were not. So again, some of y'all got basically fucked off. But then when it comes down to a state of religious basis, um, I'm going to keep it a bean. Like some of y'all may come from a family where your family members may say, oh, we, uh, we praise God right here. We praise God right here. Grandma used to have herbal remedies. Everything else go as well and come find out your grandma was a dark witch. She just covered up whoever was in your family. They was a dark witch and they lied to you and stuff like that. That was well. So again, instead of following up behind them, when it comes down to their steps, this could be a struggle when it comes to somebody, when it comes to their religious practices and stuff like that. Though as well. So again, you may be, if you are a spiritualist or a leader and you're trying to tell somebody, they not taking too kind to you because the only thing they know is religion. So again, somebody's not listening to you when it comes down to spirituality because they feel like, no, again, even if you tell them or not. Now, the flip side here, though, is well, I do feel like whoever this is, if they are into some form of teachings, if you are working with other people, you might slow down because everybody not going to get it like that. So, again, this is where you're going to have to shop around for the best teacher that may benefit you at this same time, though, as well, because you ain't going to have no breakthrough between you and somebody. All right, let's go. Now, this repeat of feeling that's coming back in your life with this seven of wands and this king of swords, baby, you're going to have to stand your ground with them real tough because whoever this is, whatever you believe in, you believe in. Like, this is where you're going to have to have that personal power where you're going to have to say, ain't nobody going to shake me. I'm having unwaverable faith. Whatever the fuck you believe in at this point in time, though, is weird because you have to be like, look, I don't care. I like, I like, I like what I like. I like me. I like this, whatever the fuck it is, though, as well, because I'm hearing something about some form of obesity. So, again, you may be dealing with somebody that may talk about your weight or criticize you or something like that, though, as well, and that may be, like, the last straw. Like, if you want to lose weight or something like that, though, you can lose weight, but not on somebody else's dime. It's kind of like, if I have to lose weight because you think I'm going to be more desirable, bitch, I'll eat. Like, does that make sense, though, as well? Like, we can wrap this shit up. 
Man, we can wrap this shit up. Like, for real. Some of y'all, y'all can wrap this shit up. Because, again, that shit ain't doing nothing stressing y'all. Some of, some of y'all over there with somebody to stress you the fuck out. You over there stress eating like a motherfucker. Whoever this is. So, it really ain't working out for you. Whoever this is, it's not. Like, you stress eating a motherfucker, stress you out, and then want to call you fat. Bitch, I'm stress eating because you keep stressing me the fuck out, and then you want to talk about me being fat. The fuck? Now, we also got Nine of Wands, the Queen of Pentacles, the Devil card in reverse, and the Four of Pentacles. I like this, because some of y'all, that's why I said, when you stand your ground and you learn how to defend you or to protect you for your sanity and also your peace and not coming from a shadow with sick place, this is going to bring you some state of peace. When you recognize where you're going to get stable and where you're going to live and stuff like that, though, that's when your money going to start coming in and stuff like that, though. It don't have to be big bucks, but it's something that's more stability-wise. It's like something that you want to do, something that's going to... uh bring you some some of y'all may work in logistics or something like that though as well i don't know there may be some you want to work in shit i don't know some of y'all work in logistics or something like that when you get stable that's when shit gonna start rolling in your life though as well some of y'all y'all may be looking for a counterpart whoever this is you may be looking for a counterpart or something like that though as well i'm gonna keep it a bang some of y'all marriages may be divorcing or y'all relationships may be coming to a divorce because some of y'all got y'all like divine masculine coming in and i don't say that some of y'all got y'all divine masculine coming in though as well and whoever this is it could be divine it's divine masculine i still say divine feminine flip it however you want to message apply and apply Somebody divine masculine coming in, but at the same time, somebody could be married or somebody wants to open up their connection. But again, that's not going to work. Whoever this is, though, as well, because their true partner is showing up. So, <laughs> this ain't going to work out. Whoever this is, though, as well, because maybe you got a consistent connection with somebody where y'all got money, y'all do certain shit and stuff like that, though, as well. But no. Like, that's not going to work. Like, it's 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 not gonna work. I'm telling you, like some of y'all, you may end up divorcing if you're on this because this is an emperor, he'll right. So this may go the way that you want to go, though, as well. But open up your marriage and your connection so you can be with this particular person. It's not gonna work for you. So if you got any type of difference in beliefs, though, as well, or something like that, though, this is where it may be a challenge in between you, though, as well. So y'all may have a difference when it comes down to a form of spirituality. Y'all may have a difference when it comes down to certain things, though, as well. But whoever this is that wants something to benefit them, it's possibly not gonna work out because I'm telling you, somebody's divine partner coming in. And whoever this is, you may have noticed that if you have opened your relationship or open certain connections and stuff like that, you may have experienced a lot of problems for some of y'all if there's anything when it comes down to converting when it comes down to anybody when it comes down to religion it feels a bit forceful so somebody may be delaying that process somebody doesn't really want to tell you the truth when it comes down to a situation because you may be overstepping the mark and somebody feel like i got me i got me could you stop like whoever this is so somebody keeps trying to cross your boundaries when it comes down to a form of spirituality and stuff like that though as well so you're gonna have to tell somebody baby back up because whoever this is like their perspective is not your perspective. I do feel like that, though. Like, some of y'all, you may be having marital problems, too, because of how you raise your kid or raise your child or unfairness or injustice that goes on, though, as well. Some of y'all may have problems when it comes down to the political system, too, though, as well. Remember, Rome wasn't built overnight. This is built on white supremacy, so you can't change everybody's mind frame. All it takes is one white person per day, per year, per quota, and that's how you start a change in the world. So, again, that's how you do that. But whoever this is with this world card, I do feel like that somebody feels like there is some norms that's not fair. Just give me like a little typical somebody gets married uh, and somebody's not able to see their child because of the marriage or financial stability or something like that, though. So this could be like dating a partner and your partner doesn't want your husband to be around your child or your your husband to be around your child. Your baby daddy don't want your hood. Your baby daddy don't want your husband be around your child, or your husband don't want your baby daddy around. Whichever one it is, it's some type of complaints or something that's going on in a state of connection though as well. Because whoever this is, they just want you. They don't give a fuck though as well. So again, some of y'all may be going down a family court or something like that though as well, or. You may be going to family court or something like that, though, as well. If it's family court, trivia court, whatever the fuck it is, could be just fucking child support. Bitch, I don't know. Some of y'all going somewhere to get some state of resolve because, again, y'all are not getting some fucking resolution because whoever this is, they keep trying to supersede an issue or come to a conclusion on something, though, as well. It's causing more damage. But for some of y'all, y'all don't want the tower moment to happen anyway. So, again, if I had to shout out them goddamn cooks just to get y'all ass to see for something, though, as well, because you kept seeing something, you kept lying on an issue emotionally or mentally. And just had to say, look, miss you, you keep sitting up there, keep saying you finna make a way out of something. We just trying to show you, you can't feel them fucking cups up. Boom. Some of y'all, this just karma. We just keep it a beat. Some of y'all, it's karma. I said that last night. All right, let's go.
Now we got six of swords. We also got the queen of pentacles. Now this is where some of y'all, whoever this is, where they may relocate. Some of y'all need to do that like astrogram. Mm -hmm. Go ask that on Duma Beach. Go ask her what that is though. <laughs> go ask that bitch. She said no. But I'm just saying, go Google it where you say so you put in your birth chart or something like that though as well where you find out where you can be more stable or just figure out where the wind is or just act spirit or something like that though. For me, I said my mom where I want to move. I want to be like PBM. And you know how they had that pendulum and they swung that bitch around. They see which state they land on. Some of y'all may got to figure that out when it comes down to a state of a situation though as well. So that may be best and benefited for you though as well when it comes down to a state of a situation. Now, how I'm seeing the six of swords just a little bit. Some of y'all, if you have been looking for change, ushering for change or petition for some state of advice, it is coming in, but you also got to be welcoming and accepting to it but I think it'll, like, you maybe feel like you bombarded when it comes down to something because you're like I just got my life stable you can't wear a spirit because again we don't know what the hell you've been doing because we got a little bit of black magic white magic and everything else though as well so we don't know what you've been going on so again don't reject your motherfucking prayers whoever you feel so be mindful of that don't reject your prayers and then be sitting there like I think I can I think I can I think I'm ready and then boom now your ass ain't going nowhere baby now you stuck again making the same damn petition and please right now again i tell you this partnership is coming in but it's going to cause a whole lot of problems in your family dynamic though as well could be with your daughter could be with your child's father for some of y'all i'm telling you could be your child's father could be your child's father the child's father going through this or it could be with the daughter or this lady could be younger than this masculine whatever it is but it's that's when you're going to start experiencing a lot of come down to this person coming into your life though as well because there's a whole lot of drama that goes on maybe you keep your family and your business too much or something like that though as well because again this could be somebody that feels like they do no wrong when it comes down to a state of a situation though as well so again this looks like a little bit of Finding to where like y'all too close y'all too needy y'all too around each other when they come to most cases that this could be like oh i'm having a bad time so i'm gonna come around and my life is fucked up so again it seems like y'all don't have like room to breathe in a relationship though as well because it is or again it feels like um you know how you get those boundaries where you have to develop that at an early age because oh you should buy me this so you should do this so you should do this so that may be causing a problem though as well whether you're made in marrying or mating with someone who has some state of financial stability or something like that though as well sibling too i'm hearing your sibling got something to do with this but whoever this is it's like whether you're being with somebody who has financial success somebody thinks that you always supposed to give 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 because they like not and going in the direction that it is that they needed to go because you got the queen of wands some y'all i'm telling you it could be your mother <laughs> the baby mama your daughter or it could be a masculine. Flip the rose, whoever this is that's going through this. Now, with this Queen of Wands and also the Fool card with the Eight of Cups, we also got the Four of Wands. We got the Six of Cups and the Lovers. This is where this competition came about, and it's coming back from the past. So, again, you may be recognizing that you may be at your status quo, where you went through the same thing, that the same thing your mama did to you, the same thing your child could be going through for them that are currently going through it. So, you may be recognizing that certain issues uh, may be revving his head around here or something like that, though. I be need it. I need them. Don't do that. Because I know you'll sit there and be spiteful. Because I know somebody has, because you left it over here, it was full. And then somebody sat up there and just started ripping them out up there. They need to stop touching my shit because I'm going to sit down. They don't need to know. They don't need to know. All right. Whoever says you may be recognized that you and your daughter may be going through the same thing that you and your mother may have went through. Because with this four wands, you may have put somebody out. Some of y'all, your daughters may have slept with your man. If they didn't sleep with your man or something like that, though, as well, it could be promiscuous behavior that may be getting the best of them, though, as well. So you may be trying to figure out how can you develop some state of boundaries or um if this is your daughter or this is another feminine in your life, though, as well, because whoever this is, is Queen of Wands, she may be a good looker or she may be somebody that's like, you can feel the sexual energy onto them, though, as well, to the point to where they feel like I can do whatever I want. But at the same time, when it comes down to their promiscuous ways, they don't like to be responsible for a lot of things, though, as well. So it's like a catch-22. So it's kind of like, say, for instance, like, I'm gonna be the, I used to be the side bitch and then I get married and my husband cheating on me and then I'm like, I never done this before. You have. But you just didn't do it then. So, again, this is like something that's coming around full circle, though, as well. And it's requiring some of y'all to uh, check back and look over your life. 
Some of y'all, somebody may be going through a period of where you hear me say where it may be sacral trauma that may come up because somebody may not want it to be uh, sexually active at the same time, though, as well, though, because of certain things. So, again, you may have a partner whose love language may be sex, uh, sex or something like that, though, as well. So, it may be causing a problem, though, as well, because somebody got like some trauma that could be within their womb or something like that, though, as well. And they don't want to for some of y'all, just somebody never hit puberty. So again, and I say that for real, so their body may be developed, whoever this person is, but they never went through puberty. So this is somebody that didn't have like a childhood, adolescence phase and stuff like that though as well. So this may be a block or something that they may be going through. So this may be why this person may be overeating or they may be experiencing thyroid problems or uh, gaining their weight or something like that though. If it's not that, they could become off like they're depressed and they don't move suffer or they doing certain shit. They trying to fit in with certain people. You like, Ugh. like, does it make sense? Like this, that person, they hadn't got there. So again, and like this is them so yep there may be something now we got the ten of wands and the nine of swords and i said don't block out your help because if you do block out your help though as well and you sit back and you be like oh, well i should have got this help he said ask your angels for help for people you're gonna turn around and get the people in your life that's gonna stress you the fuck out so you're gonna be back worrying about the same thing and if you are an entrepreneur and you got any type of business affairs or something like that though going on this is now the time to rework your strategy rework your marketing if there's any deals contracts negotiations it's the best time to rework 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 like a rework my bad so it's, it's kind of it's the time to rework like a lot of things in your life though as well so you can bring some state of newness because again some of y'all working too hard need to bear minimum in certain situations i'm just gonna be honest maybe on negotiation skills is piss poor or you just it's, yes like your negotiation skills is piss poor but for some of y'all um <laughs> Some of y'all, your negotiation skills is piss poor. If it's not piss poor, um, which it is, uh, some of y'all don't know how to market. Like, I'm just going to be honest. Like, some of y'all don't know how to market. Like, for real. All right. Now, we got the queen. We got the father of pentacles. We got the two of cups. And we also got the queen of swords. Ooh, you got two different approaches, though, as well. Now, this could be trying to merge two people together, get two people on the same page when it comes down to a relationship and getting two people to work along or get along. Because it's Queen of Swords, they're more factual. Then you got somebody that's money minded when it comes down to a state of relationship, though, as well. So, money and communication really don't go hand in hand unless you're spending it. So, again, if there is a connection between you and someone else, though, as well, y'all trying to figure out how do you fit. How do you work this out? Again, this look like two peas in a pod, but they also opposite. Like, I'm telling you, it's like two peas in a pod, but it's like opposites attract. Because we got the King of Swords. We also got the Three of Pentacles, the Devil card, and also the Ace of Cups. Somebody don't play fair. I'm telling you, somebody wants you to be in that third party, baby. I'm telling you, somebody counterpart, divine partner, they came along and they fucking up their relationship. And this is ass for one of y'all. Jesus. <sighs> All right, I'm through. Now, whoever this is, this could cause some state of problem where somebody needs to go a divorce or y'all may have to go to some state of counseling or something like that, though, as well. Because just like the cheaper to keep her, like back in the day, well, we got insurance together, we got this, and I'm all these particular things, though, as well. They may have to work this out into the kids' face and stuff like that, though, as well. So it may have to be like some legal paperwork or something like that, though, as well. I don't know how that works out. Like, I, I really don't know how that works out. So you probably have to ask somebody that's more experienced in law. To look over these particular things, though, as well, when it comes down to your actual benefits, when it comes down to health, dental, vision, and all those different types of things, life insurance, 401ks, whatever the fuck it is you're investing into, right? You may have to ask somebody that's more experienced in law that could go over that, though, as well, if y'all trying to come to a state of a medium, because whoever this is, this is, this is my wife. This my husband. Like, whoever this is, like, they just keep going back and forth with this state of mind frame, though, as well. But they don't see that this cycle is old. So somebody may be going through a state of divorce, though, as well. For some of y'all, I'm going to keep it a bean. It may be your friend with the Ace of Cups. It may be your friend that somebody may end up with. <sighs> right? Uh, for some of y'all, uh, somebody you thought was a friend. You just going to say it like that? But for some of y'all, though, as well, um... This is what you're going to learn. You can't bring everybody to your bedroom because the three of pentacles, that world card in reverse, and that devil card, they're like, just a little, you know, y'all was just, frick, frick, frick. you know, y'all just had a little things going on and boom, somebody messed up their relationship due to third party activity and somebody fucked around and fell in love and got attached to somebody. Y'all had one too many drinks <laughs> and it was a one night extravaganza. This is just jokes. Like, I'm saying, don't take this personal. 
Um, so that may be it though as well. Some of y'all may be recognized like that reading that I said last night. Your friend may be in love with you. Yikes. Um, seriously, and they keeping it a secret or your friend slept with somebody that was close to you with this ace of swords and lovers to the page of swords and they're not telling you the truth and they just trying to suss it out to fill out do you know so this is that's just like okay so they come to like trying to bring up certain conversation make little innuendos because they want to let you know and they're trying to see how you're going to respond to the state of a situation though as well Again, because this may be somebody that blew out your calendar and snubbed you up under the bus, though, as well. So they can get in bed with somebody, though, as well, or to receive some state of opportunity or promotion. So, again, you may have thought you was cool with somebody or something like that, though, as well. Shout to turn around and snuff you and we're behind your goddamn back and got a relationship with this man. Start talking shit about you and stuff. Start copying you, mimicking you, lying, trying to make you like you dumb you don't know the things that it is that you know and boom did this shit get out of hand so now this person that caused the mess where this mask may be coming into your life though as well whether it's business finances or fun hold on get a man out of your money all right but whoever this is whether it's like a mess or something that was created when it comes down to a state of a situation somebody's like can you help me so it's like this person comes back around and now you kind of like I had one too many drinks. It's cool. I'm going to hear you. Need a pet embassy. <laughs> Some of y'all, y'all got drunk and y'all ended up somewhere. Because why is it coming up? All right, now let's get back on subject. Now, before we go, before we get on up out of here, we got to change your life and we also got the four cups. This that tower moment that some of y'all didn't want to have in your life, though, as well. Like, this was the chaos that was bound to happen when it comes down to a state of destruction. And some of y'all was holding on and holding on and holding on holding on. This could be that person again. Some of y'all, I really feel like this could have been you. You could have been constantly looking out for somebody. You could have forewarned them and you could have told them. So this person may be in their feelings. They may not want to move on. They just want to grip towards the past. And the more they grip towards the past, it seems like everything and every reality is crumbling down. Or shit just breaks. It's how you know when it's time for you to get something up when shit just start breaking and shit. you like, I was going to fix that. Bam, that shit broke. Damn. Like, that's how you know when you holding on to shit too long and stuff like that. Though. That's so fucked up. I'm telling you. That's that nine of pentacles in reverse energy where you just want to hoard shit. Now we got King of Wands. We also got the hair in reverse, the page of cups, the judgment. And then we also got the nine of wands. Some of y'all may have somebody come back saying, baby, baby, please. I did not believe in marriage, but I believe in marrying you. Whoever this is, and you like, mm mm. Uh uh. No, I don't want you to be with me and stuff like that. That was weird. Because, baby, you ain't believe in me. Remember, you ain't want to marry me. That's how one of y'all is, though. If this same time, and somebody like, baby, 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 please. And this person just taking their time to give you an offer and shit like that. That was weird. And the ace of pentacles in reverse. Versus somebody's like, no, like whoever this is, somebody firm on it, no, 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 whoever this is, no, somebody may have been doing like a little man, little, a little manifestation work or something like that, though. And then, two of you did marry somebody, you got a relationship. Why this person trying to kill you for some state of status and your ass just not recognizing it? Because why I see that like judgment. It's something with you in the seat, hope. That's all I know because I seen that last night, so it's you. It's somebody last night when I was doing like my little meditation before I was going to bed, though, was where I seen somebody to where like it was like these people to where like they was coming about the water. Like they was just <sighs> like that, though, was where like them people was grasping for air. Like they was on top of the sand and they was just trying to get some air or something like that, though, was where. Well. Not, yeah, it was a little bit of Wakanda saying, a little bit. So that's that difference in spirituality, though, too. But for some of y'all, this could be somebody that overthrows their emotion. But for some of y'all, somebody killed you for fame, baby. I'm just keeping on somebody trying to kill you for fame, boss. For real. Because mm. we got the lovers in reverse, the queen of cups, the moon card, the seven of cups, the five of cups, the four of wands, the tower card, and the king of pentacles. Somebody only married you for money. Somebody only married you for necessity. Somebody tried to kill you for fame. And this is where the truth may be coming and down. So I see why somebody's saying you don't know if you want to be with somebody right now, though, as well, because they got a lot of shit going on in their life, though, as well. And it's like, baby, uh -uh. Oh. it's kind of like whoever this is, it's kind of like you may be recognizing that um, you may be recognizing that uh, somebody tried to murder you. Or something like that, though, was when they had a whole lot of shit going on. Or somebody tried to do this to them or something like that, though, was weird to the point where you like, I don't trust you. Because whoever this is, like, some of y'all 
I'm going to keep it a bean. If you was doing healer work by yourself and you was in a relationship where you was like no contact with this particular person, you would probably be able to assess it a little bit better. But whoever this is that may be going to therapy or going through these particular programs or something like that as well or healing methods or whatever the fuck it is that's going on, you want this person to be responsible for the pain that it is that they caused you because it's the truth that you didn't want to accept when it came down to this person. So that's that. Now the last two, we got the five of one. And the six of wands. There we go. Again, there go that competition. And again, as soon as you get through that, it's like shit don't stop hold. You got another motherfucker that's in competition with you causing a whole lot of problems. Like that baby, don't get too motherfucking comfortable because you need to go get you a goddamn blanket. No the fuck you know, because I'm not gonna be cold. That shit don't cook me all the way. Again, I keep telling you. Whoever this is with this five of wands going back to this six of wands, sweetie. Here come the competition. Coming back again. This somebody that want to argue with you again, want to fight with you, want to do all this with you down because they got to have some state of victory. But the good thing about this five of wands is it said this is a problem that you can resolve at this state and time though as well. So this may be somebody where they may be very hostile and they approach whoever this is though as well. But whoever this is that could be hostile with you though as well where you might have had some type of arguments, conflict, disagreements and stuff like that though as well. This may be a person now that may want to play nice with you and some of y'all you may be like bitch move like so i don't know if this person traumatized you or something like that though as well or y'all arguments just got just a little too spicy like does it make sense that y'all arguments just was a little too spicy and stuff like that though as well because you and this person when y'all went there y'all went there so i don't know if this you and somebody else when y'all enough if you book i don't know if this like a ritualistic maiden bullshit, you know, like back in the day where uh with animal kingdom type shit, because some of y'all is in y'all animalistic energy down. So this could be like how back in the day where you know the men used to get to fighting over women. So if you got two women and they masculine energy, they feel like they gonna fight fight over this man. Whoever it is they feel like they're gonna fight fight. They're gonna fight fight over you or they're gonna fight fight over this man, baby. Whoever this is fight fight. Better the look of you book. Some of y'all may have got jumped too. We got the Emperor. We also got Seven of Wands. We also got the Food card, the Strength card, and then we also got the Six of Swords. Again, I said that though, like somebody's trying to stop you from going with somebody or being with somebody though as well or being a part of some state of relationship. For some of y'all, this could be the budding friends, the friends and the romance and stuff like that though as well. Where you may be thinking that this person chastises you, they make certain comments, but try to be little to you when it comes down to certain things though as well. But this friend or person, they may like you too, but at the same time though, they don't want you to have this person. So again, this person may be trying to come back around you to have some state of connection with you. Or to make amends, though. But it looked like some of y'all, the people that was against you, like, all of them, they got used. Like, all these people got washed. These people got washed. Like, I'm telling you, they got washed. Either some people got their bank accounts drained. Um, They got used. They got used for money. They got caught up in crimes. They got court cases. Shit costing them out of their ass, though. Well, like, I'm going to keep it vain. Like, somebody got washed or for some of y'all, this lifestyle that it is that you were living, it cost you a whole lot of problems and stuff like that, though. So, I don't know if somebody got their money doing criminalistic activities where it's like drugs and shit. Shout out to you. Give me some money. Dollars a dollar. Remember that. Okay, so that's two, a thousand and a dollar. Now, we got the hermit card and the verse. We also got the four pillars though as well for some of y'all there's somebody that think about themselves a lot like this may be somebody that's always engulfed in their emotions when they come down to a lot of things that's going on so this may be somebody that don't want to talk to you though as well but they want to talk to you like it's kind of funny that somebody want to talk to you but now know if they want to talk to you it could be a fear-based state relationship or somebody want to be your friend so this that hey on them and be breathing over your shoulders that's about to be breathing over your shoulders shit and stuff like that though as well to see what the hell that you got going on <laughs> not literally, but I'm just talking about this talk you. Could be social media, could be on feet, huh? This may be somebody that's talking you on feet. I'm gonna just keep it a bean. Again, like that's the heavy ass energy that you be feeling. Whoever this is, I told y'all when y'all got death track up in this motherfucking ass or it's in your body. So there may be that person or something like that though as well, because I'm going to just keep it a bean. For some of y'all, if somebody tries to sacrifice somebody, somebody don't want to come forward to you and be your goddamn friend because they don't know if you're going to try to sacrifice them. <laughs> Does it make sense? Did I say that right? Yes. I don't know if this person tried to sacrifice you. For some of y'all, they did. Some of them, I don't know if they was affiliated with these people. 
But for some of y'all, it's something about this person, they don't want to come to you. You're going to try to sacrifice them. So somebody like, hell no, nah. they like you a little, you're like, fuck that little. So this somebody may try to come into your life, or whoever this may come into your life, that may start arguments or something like that, though, as well. They may start some type of arguments or conflict or something with you, though, as well. And instead of expressing themselves, they, huh? <laughs> so it's kind of like, whoever this is, they may start arguing with you and then just walk the fuck out because they ain't going to say what it is that they need to say. I'm just like, shit, you ain't finna try to kill me. So this is my just like, you ain't finna kill me, ho. So I don't know what the fuck to tell y'all, but some of y'all will receive a victory, but some of y'all, this victory only will come about once you start speaking your truth and once you start speaking your truth and you put some actions behind it. So again, you can sit there and think, 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 all oh, you motherfucker won't then get mad because somebody else doing it or somebody beat you to the punch or something like that though was weird. But you never say it, nothing. lose your feet, lose your seat when it comes down to a state of a comp like when it comes down to this competition or somebody being in competition with you. But for some of y'all, there is somebody that is nothing if you book and they is starting up with you or something like that though as well where they trying to cause just a little bit of problem. Yes. It takes a food. Right. Don't close the eyes. I told you Coyote. <gasps> Thank you. Oh shit, wait a minute, stop playing here. Okay, mm -hmm. get your ass up. No, look, no, 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 get your ass up. No, no ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am, get your ass up. What's up, girl? Get your ass up. Um, wait a minute, ho, I just seen that. This is a bigger page. Let me just tell you that this is a bigger book, so don't know what the fuck to tell you guys here. Because yes, okay, I seen this. It said an entity used to erase people minds. I don't know who the fuck need to hear this. It said you are dealing with a shapeshifter, a trip, a trickster, a spirit, and demonology. A person who joins a coven or a group. Hermes Greek God. Chinese Monkey King, Loki, a Nase, a Coyote, a Raven, Eshu, Yoruba Practices, Maui, and Prometheus. And Prometheus. And the only reason why I said this though as well because this Coyote came out that trick. Now this could be somebody your mind might be playing tricks on you, or this was a person that you came in contact with. So again, somebody, whoever this is, if like this is kind of like a self fulfilling prophecy. If a trickster came into your life and it was spiritually anointed to get you to go around a certain path, or the spiritual this trickster came upon your path for a state of a certain reason, though, as well, it already did its job. But it's kind of like you making it worse, sir. Like doesn't make sense because again, like if you don't want to heal or something like that, though, as well. So again, I don't know if this is like your dreams, having nightmares or something like that, though, maybe playing with you or something like that, though. Some of y'all that could be the case, some of y'all is not. But it's kind of like, it's kind of like you're going to push it on out. Like, does it make sense? So again, if you don't go through the mental health precautions, the spiritual precautions, state of acknowledgement that it requires you, then um, you may end up pushing it back out in different ways though as well so this may show up in like self-sabotage grief depression uh not getting the things that it is that you need out of life so let's see let's get one card and then we'll eat on the ground this one now kiss my ace thank you seven i'm talking about the number seven the child knows the way to joy and happiness. The child offers the return of a second innocence, a time born of wisdom and not of naivety. This card allows you to correct your course and offers you a second chance. It brings you the possibility of redemption and enter the heaven while on earth. The child is here to release you from the habit of being yourself. Um, and to the help you require the beginner's mind so that you can see life as for the first time. Brain open to learning and discovery. Who is your spouse or partner today? Can you see them with fresh eyes? Who is looking back at you in the mirror in the morning? Become a mystery unto yourself and reconnect with a sense of childlike wonder. The child comes to show you how you can correct the course of your life without being punished. Set yourself free from conditioning yourself for suffering. 
you were born unfettered and happy and can be so again. If you make the choice right now, the child will help you climb out of the hole you may have dug yourself into, you may have dug yourself into to recover your sense of play. And on that note, girl, didn't I just say that? So good night. End it. End it. Damn it. End it. Shit.